आज का दिन बीएसएनएल के लिए फख्र का दिन है टेलीकॉम की दुनिया के लिए एक ऐतिहासिक दिन है द लॉन्च ऑफ हाई क्वालिटी नेक्स्ट जनरेशन टेलीकॉम सर्विस ऑफ वी बिना रुके बिना थमे बिना थके चलने वाले बीएसएनएल की कामयाबी के सफर का ये एक और रिमार्केबल माइलस्टोन है द डायनामिक एंड कोलैबोरेटिव पार्टनरशिप बिटवीन बीएसएनएल इंडिया टेलीकॉम जॉइंट एंड साई द लॉन्ग स्टैंडिंग एंड रिलायबल पार्टनर ऑफ बीएसएनएल इज नाउ हेरल्डिंग अ न्यू एरा इन टेलीकॉम रिवोल्यूशन बाय लॉन्चिंग द फ्यूचरिस्टिक वीडियो एंड वॉइस ओवर ब्रॉडबैंड सर्विसेज बाय यूजिंग वीओआईपी टेक्नोलॉजी Uh, from the right hand side a sip a, a sip telephone is connected where the child photo is there which is getting connected to the broadband modem and then the broadband dslam then it goes into bsnl mpns network and then there is a soft switch which facilitate to make the voip call now this soft switch in the next diagram Uh, has the facility of authentication of the subscriber who is making a call as well as the facilities which are available with the called party in the application then we have a billing uh, we have a billing uh, server we have a media server and we have a provisioning server and database server keeps the record uh, of all the subscribers incoming and outgoing in fact uh, at present Uh, only a bsnl customer broadband customer can make a call to another uh, broadband customer of bsnl can connect this particular phone to a lcd tv and projector like we we will see here when uh, our chief guest will inaugurate this particular service and it is it has a adjustable camera means if the picture of a called party or calling party is not able to see with each other the picture can be rotated with the help of a software next uh, this service is being provided through a backbone which is extended throughout the country with a reliable mpls network by bsnl at present this particular soft switch is placed at amdabad uh, which will cover the whole country fortunately bsnl is still a market leader in this segment of broadband with a subscriber base of approximately 8 million we remain the largest isp in the country and hope to retain the spot for years to come for this we are planning a plethora of services which will serve the dual purpose of increasing penetration of broadband in the country let me assure you that this service voice and video or broadband or voip as popularly known is only a beginning in this direction and we have got a very able support from our uh, partners for in this service that is sis sai info systems limited without whose uh, continuous efforts this day would not have come my colleague sri vadwa ji and mr anil jain have already delved on the subject of uip services at length hence no need for me to repeat them but let me tell you that bond between bsnl and sai info systems is quite old and is getting stronger by the day in fact recently they have received a purchase order from us for implementation of first phase of knowledge network another dream project of sri sam petroda let me take this opportunity to congratulate sri sunil kakkar and his entire team in sis for this with this i would now like to invite sri sam petroda ji to make the first call to our chief general manager gujarat uh, telecom circle and commercially launch the service thank you hello mr pargo how are you mr upadhyay mr kakkar mr wadwa mr jain officers of the bsnl friends from sis press ladies and gentlemen good afternoon it is indeed a special privilege for me to be here with you to inaugurate this new service i am delighted to be a part of this event i get lot of credit 
for telecom but the real credit goes to a lot of my colleagues from ITS, CADR, BSNL, MTNL, private sector, CDOT, all of these people worked very, very hard for many, many years to get us where we are. I get credit for it, but the real work gets done by people at the ground level. I know how difficult it is to go from 2 million lines to 800 million lines in a short span of 20 years. In the history of a nation, 20 years is not very long. With the help of all of these talent in Telecom today, we are a nation of a connected billion people. I've been saying that the first phase of the Telecom revolution is ending. Second phase of the telecom revolution is just about to begin. Now that we are a nation of a connected billion, we really need to use telecom institutions and infrastructures to really take us to the next level. And that is all about broadband, broadband, broadband. We have huge amount of optical fiber. In the country, we have million kilometer of optical fiber, of which over 600,000 kilometers is the BSNL. This optical fiber is almost like gold in the ground. We need to take this gold and create productive assets out of this gold.